Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing some deep cleaning. So I am mostly going to be focusing on the main level. I might end up making it down to the basement, but I do have a few things on my list. So of course we are going to be doing like some regular tidying around the house, but I also want to clean off our granite countertops and reseal those just to protect those a bit more. We also have our really tall fan in our living room. We have like 18 feet tall ceilings and I have yet to clean them since we moved in because I have not had anything that I could reach them with. And so we finally got a tool for that. So I'm going to clean that today. That's going to be terrible, but very, very needed. I'm also going to strip down all of the cushions on our couch and wash all of those covers. And then I also want to give a little bit of a focus to some of the baseboards and some of like the banisters and things and just kind of like deep clean that. And then I also want to focus on some of the windows. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get everything on my list done today. I just want to tackle as much as I can today. And I want to take you guys along with me because I know this is going to be super good motivation to go ahead and tackle whatever projects you are dealing with. So let's go ahead and get to it. Wide awake is the way that you left me. Sat beside in your car in the backseat. Wide awake is the way that you left me. Oh. Now it's clear we are here back at your house. And I keep fading into the background. Okay, that was so so gross but you can already see it looks so much better it had not been cleaned since we moved in like almost two years ago because we just I couldn't find anything to clean it and I didn't want to spend like 50 bucks I don't know so I kept looking but I found this little thing at Lowe's I think and it was like ten dollars you can see like how dirty that was this was completely clean I'm hoping that I can get this off and actually run it through the wash because it's really sick but I'm gonna show you like all the big huge pieces of dust that fell off the fan so gross please no judgment <laughs>
sing until my lungs give out your beautiful I have literally spent probably 20 minutes at least searching and scouring my house for my carpet cleaner like hose because I have the carpet cleaner but I can't find the hose and I don't know why it's not like next to it but it's not I was actually going to be putting the couch covers in the washer but after starting to get this big one off I was like I don't know, it was so tight to get off even. I was like, I just don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it back on and if it happens to shrink. And so I'm like, I'm gonna first try carpet cleaning and if that doesn't work, then I'll go do that, I guess. I'm just deciding if I'm going to actually pull the cushions off on the ground and just like carpet clean them with the actual like carpet cleaner and not use the hose. Oh, that's crazy, I've never done that. But I think I might try to just carpet clean like the tops of the cushions with the actual carpet cleaner. And I hope this is not a big mistake. So wish me luck. <laughs> Wanna put you in that spotlight Looking at you all night, all night I'll sing until my lungs give out your beautiful I've gotten so many questions from you guys about like what happened to my old Dyson. I still have my Dyson, I still use it, but for big jobs, I've just been using this one. And I'm gonna show you guys like how much it pulled out and then I'll show you there's zero hair wrap. There's so much I love about this vacuum, but seriously amazing. <laughs> Just 
Okay, so I wanted to take just a minute and show you guys because I've explained a lot of times but a lot of you guys still are asking me like how this works. So I've just finished sealing my granite countertops and now I am going to put together my soap station. So this is the Grove Collaborative stoneware tray. I have not seen one like it anywhere else, but that just kind of like holds everything and makes it look like it belongs. This one is the Bubble Up sponge dish, and this one is the Bubble Up dish brush set. And I also get a ton of questions about these. So these are just oil and vinegar bottles that I got from Target. One has my dish soap and then one has my hand soap. And you just fill up your trays with some soap and then you are just going to fill them up a little bit with water and then you're just able to keep your sponge and your dish brush on here and then whenever you're ready you basically just push this down and because it has the soap and water already in there it kind of suds this up for you so you don't have to use a bunch of extra dish soap and it also just makes the job a lot easier i have never had either of these get moldy or anything like that because the sponge and brush just actually sit above the water so they don't actually sit in the water and then I do change this out probably about twice a week sometimes three times but usually about twice a week and that is how it works and I do get both of those from Grove Collaborative so they do have a good deal right now I will link it down below for you guys if you guys want to check it out if you've never purchased from them otherwise if you don't want to purchase from them you can also get them on Amazon and I think those are the only two places I've ever seen them but I really really love them they are definitely like some of my essentials Okay, so I just have to pause for a second and say these work so stinking good. So I am just using an e cloth, just general purpose cloth, like one of my favorites to like actually wipe down the windows. And then to dry the window, I am using the Window Genie. I have never used this before. This is not sponsored or anything. You guys that have been here for a while know that I have been obsessed with e-cloths for multiple years. And you guys have been listening to me talk about them forever, but they're amazing. But this is a new product I bought when it was on sale, like I wanna say back in December. And I've been waiting to do my windows, putting it off. There's no streaks and it was just so easy because it's just like a window mitt and it's double-sided. I'm always impressed with their products, but 
that's just crazy to me. So, I guess I don't have a lot of excuses not to do my windows now. <laughs> Back to it. I'll put my hand on it. Okay. Oh my gosh.
Okay, so it is the next day. My dad is actually coming to stay with us for a few days from Japan. And so we're gonna head downstairs and just kind of tidy up and vacuum everything. And I'm also going to take like a wall brusher or I think it's just like really a floor dust or whatever, but I'm gonna use it on the walls. And I'm going to go ahead and just like wipe down the walls because we do have a lot of sawdust on the walls and just kind of getting things done. And then I'm also going to head up to the boys' old room upstairs slash new guest bedroom and just kind of tidy that up. I have a lot of things I was hoping to get a makeover done before they get here, but it just didn't happen. So I'm gonna go up there and just kind of tidy everything up and then we should be good to go for them to arrive. But if you get it's not on me, yeah, yeah, yeah. The way you make it, make sure your hands on my silver, like keep pulling the trigger, alright. This very thing for people like them. Oh, no, no. When I lay on my mind, I'm feeling so fly up in the zone now. I'm like a golden crown, world and high up in the sky. For people like them, we don't care much for people like them. But I lay on my mind, I'm feeling so fly up in the zone now. I'm like a golden crown, world and high. Just wanna go, go 